Well today everybody, in this video we're going to be talking about Charvel's brand new Super Strat that may just in fact be the best metal guitar of 2022. Let's get into it. Hey, what's going on everybody? Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. Today's going to be a lot of fun. A quick little video, quick little reaction, quick little hangout with you all talking about Charvel and a brand new guitar that has really piqued my interest and I've kind of known about it for several months now. It's kind of been teased and hinted at, but it's finally here. It's finally on the market and I'm just stoked to hang out with you all and talk about it, okay? As always, if you're brand new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. With that being said, let's talk about this brand new Super Strat from Charvel. So up on your screen right now, we have, boom, the Phil Scrasso Signature Pro Mod SoCal Style 1 Signature Guitar. So like I said, man, this guitar has kind of been hinted at and I know a lot of you guys have been tagging me and like different types of like kind of, I don't know, I guess we'll say leaked photos and stuff like that online. And I didn't really want to talk about it too much because, you know, I don't know, I'm not really one for like trying to spill the beans before it comes out, um, before a product comes out, whatever. Anyway, man, yeah, it's finally here. So let's click on view now. Let's check it out. Let's dive on in and react to it, okay? So at first glance, this is like literally everything I could possibly want in a Super Strat. I mean, Silver Bird is my favorite finish of all time. Floyd Rose, I've really been stoked on Floyd Rose lately. Um, truss rod adjustment at the bottom of the neck, all of the above, one pickup, super metal, right? So, however, one glaring thing, I guess we'll say, is $1,549.99. That's a lot of money, especially for a guitar with only one pickup. Well, let's dive on into the specs. I really haven't read up on this thing too much because I kind of wanted to keep it like a, uh, a genuine reaction for this video. As I lay dying rhythm guitarist, Phil Scrasso is a formidable creative force behind the Grammy-nominated Melodic Metalcore Act, snagging MTV's 2007 Ultimate Metal God. Scrasso had contributed his ferocious chops to heavy metal supergroup Woven War and toured with Seosin and Slipknot. Oh, I didn't know he toured with Slipknot. What was he doing with Slipknot? Maybe he was like Tekken or something like that. Interesting. In his honor, Charvel presents a Phil Scrasso signature Pro Mod SoCal Style 1, Humbucker FRE, a modern take on a classic design. Heck yeah, dude. So congrats to Phil, man. This thing's awesome. I love your style, dude. I love, you know, how you spec out a guitar. It's really cool, man. So let's check it out, dude. So first and foremost, mahogany body. That makes sense. Um, you know, I think mahogany super strats are kind of, kind of like, I don't know, way better sounding than like an alder or something like that. And, you know, one could argue that tone wood isn't a real thing. I think it is, man. And I just think mahogany body guitars just sound so much better. So that's super rad. Continue to look at the guitar here. I mean, it looks like if we have all the specs that you would expect from a Charvel guitar, they kind of have a unique heel joint here with that kind of scalloped rear heel, he, rear, <laughs> real, wait, rear heel cutaway. Say that five times fast. So that's super rad. Compound fretboard radius, ebony board, one Fishman Fluence Modern pickup with the two voicings. You know, I know a lot of people love Fishman Moderns. That makes sense. One thing I find a little bit interesting is how far away the knob is away from the actual, like, body, I guess. Like, you know, most Strat knobs are, like, right here. However, it's, like, way out of the way. I know that's a huge complaint with Strats. Like, it's a design flaw, like, where the knob is too close to the hands. However, all the way down here might be a little bit too far away for some. But regardless, man, um, yeah, it's just an obvious choice to get the damn knob out of the way so we're not bumping it when we're playing. Floyd Rose 1000 series. Oh, in ooh, interesting. 1000 series, wow, okay. We'll have to talk about that here in a second. Side dot lumen lays, that makes sense. Heel mount truss rod right here at the bottom of the neck, that's cool. I love the old school toothpaste logo. And the black anodized aluminum pick guard. So overall, really cool looking guitar. Now obviously I don't have one here in my possession. I'm just spitballing and just hanging out with you guys talking about this guitar man like you know i obviously don't know how it feels or sounds or plays this is all just reactionary stuff but one thing i will say is it's interesting that there's only a 1000 series on a guitar that is this expensive because going back to another super strat that was released this year this one right here this one's only 1500 bucks and it has two humbuckers and it's a floyd rose 15 1500 series 1500 series See, look, boom. So, in this one right here, the Jim Root style, we have two EMGs, so an additional humbucker, and a more upgraded Floyd Rose system. So it's interesting how this guitar right here is a little bit more money, one less pickup, and a 1000 series. So maybe it's because the Fishman Moderns are more expensive, and maybe it costs more money to do this pick guard, and maybe it costs more money to do a silver burst finish. I'm not exactly sure, but regardless, man, 
All price points aside, this thing is pretty badass looking. And in 2022, man, Charvel just really knocked it out of the park with all of the super strats. It's like the year of the super strats. I mean, I've covered this one here on a video not too long ago. I love this one right here, the purple one. Um, and then, you know, we got the sunburst one or the sunburnt one, excuse me. I like this one right here, uh, the cherry kiss. Anyway, man, just a lot of super strats from Charvel's is what you would expect. But, you know, regardless, man, they're doing a lot of cool things this year in 2022. And this silver burst from Phil. It's just another evolution in all the stuff that Charvel's doing this year. So I think it's pretty rad, man. So everybody, in conclusion, man, maybe one day I'll get one on the channel, save up some pennies and get one. But for right now, man, I just want to make a quick little news bulletin, talk about it, share it, react to it, all the above, and hang out with you guys, all right? So you guys got to let me know your thoughts and opinions on these guitars. I love it, man. It looks cool. And like I said, maybe one day I'll get one in. So that's going to do it for this video. Quick little video today. I hope you guys are doing well. If you're brand new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. I am out of here. Stay safe, stay healthy, and stay metal. See you guys next time. Later.